Ukrainian soldiers from the 110th Separate Mechanized Brigade have shot down a Russian Su-25 attack aircraft on the Avdiivka front. Russian aircraft continue to fall. The anti-aircraft gunners of the 110th Brigade have done a great job again. They hit another Su-25 today. The invaders still haven't realized that they have no business flying in our skies. They will keep going down, said 110th Separate Mechanized Brigade named after Lt. Gen. Marko Bazruko. Recall on May 4, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky announced that the 110th Separate Mechanized Brigade had shot down a Russian Su-25 attack aircraft in Donetsk Oblast. The military noted that the occupiers have not yet realized that there is no point in flying in the Ukrainian sky, so, they will continue to fall. The Su-25 is a Soviet-era subsonic attack aircraft designed to support ground troops and destroy targets. The attack aircraft is equipped with aircraft cannons, aircraft bombs, unguided air-to-surface missiles, and guided air-to-air -air missiles. According to published data, the approximate cost of one Su-25 aircraft is $11 million. Medvedev insulted London, he called the government of Charles III morons. Former Russian President Dmitry Medvedev insulted London by calling representatives of the government of monarch Charles III morons. He spoke about this on Telegram. Medvedev said that if Britain and France continue to publicly bless the Ukrainian armed forces for the use of storm shadow, scalp, e.g. missiles against Russia, Moscow will respond adding, and practicing a response to such attacks is the goal of the planned exercises. And even His Royal Majesty's not fully educated morons should understand this. Deputy Chairman of the Russian Security Council Dmitry Medvedev commenting on the statement of British Foreign Minister David Cameron, who called on the West to continue to fight Putin to the bitter end, said this. Medvedev noted that he remembers Cameron well from the time when he served as head of the kingdom's government and created the impression of an ordinary shady Britain. According to the deputy chairman of the Russian Security Council, Cameron was then joyfully stupid and clearly reveled in his newly acquired high government position. At that time, he was not yet the patented Russophobe that he is now. Now, holding the position of head of the British Foreign Office, Cameron has given the militants of the Kyiv regime the opportunity to shoot missiles supplied by London wherever they want. Medvedev emphasized, that the Storm Shadow Stroke Scalp EG missiles supplied to Kyiv are controlled not by the armed forces of Ukraine, but by the British and French who arrived in Ukraine and under certain circumstances, the answer for such actions will fly not only to Kyiv, but also to London and Paris, and not only with conventional explosives, but also with special ammunition. Such attacks will be practiced in planned exercises, and this should be understood even by not very smart British officials like Cameron, who calls to fight Putin, in other words, with Russia. Earlier, it was reported that France transferred long-range scalp missiles that were subject to disposal to the Ukrainian army, considering this a very effective economic solution.